Mike Tyson Lifestyle Net Worth Fortune Car Collection Mansion Mike Tyson, a name synonymous with boxing greatness, is a man who has lived life on his own terms, often indulging in extravagant spending. This video offers a comprehensive insight into Tyson's opulent lifestyle. Before we dive into the details, we invite you to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. Now let's embark on this journey, early life and career. Born in 1966 in the bustling city of New York, Michael Gerald Tyson, widely known as Mike Tyson, is one of the most celebrated and contentious figures in the world of boxing. His early life was marked by hardships, including multiple run-ins with the law for minor offenses and the tragic loss of his mother when he was just 16. Boxing emerged as Tyson's beacon of hope, and he pursued it relentlessly with the guidance of his coach, Cus D'Amato, who became his legal guardian and nurtured him like his own child. Tyson's exceptional boxing prowess quickly catapulted him to stardom in the sport. By the tender age of 20, he had already clinched his world championship belt, making him the youngest boxer to secure a heavyweight title. However, his career was marred by controversy. He was disqualified in 1997 for biting an opponent's ear and was arrested for rape in 1992. Despite these hurdles, Tyson is revered as one of the greatest heavyweight boxers of all time. After a tumultuous career, Tyson now appears to be leading a comfortable life brimming with luxuries, love for cars. Tyson's passion for cars is no secret. He has owned an array of luxury vehicles, including a $40,000 Mercedes-Benz 380 SL, a $60,000 Mercedes-Benz 560 SL, a $75,000 Rolls-Royce Spur, a $95,000 Cadillac Scarlet, a $120,000 Bentley Continental T, a $130,000 Rolls-Royce Cornish, a $300,000 Bentley Continental SC, a $340,000 Rolls-Royce Ghost, a $350,000 Rolls-Royce Cullinan, a $450,000 Rolls-Royce Phantom, a $500,000 Lamborghini Super Diablo Twin Turbo, a $600,000 Jaguar XJ220, and a Ferrari F50, one of the most coveted Ferraris globally. This supercar, powered by a V12 engine, can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in a mere 3.7 seconds and reach a top speed of 202 miles per hour. Depending on its preservation status, this legendary Ferrari can easily command over $1 million. It is estimated that Tyson has owned over 100 luxury vehicles throughout his career. Real Estate Investments Abandoned Mansion When Tyson began amassing substantial wealth, he purchased a mansion in Salvington, Ohio, where he resided during the 1980s. The property was distinctive and luxurious, adorned with golden details and black marble coatings. The mansion also featured large wooden sheds where Tyson likely hosted his events. Although the property is now deserted, it was once a symbol of extreme luxury. In 2014, a church acquired the property for $1.1 million and transformed it into a shrine. After several renovations, the once neglected sheds have become spaces where the church serves ex-wife's mansion. During his marriage to Monica Turner, Tyson resided in a stunning mansion in a gated community in Bethesda, Maryland. The 19,000-square-foot residence, situated on a 2.5-acre lot, offered every conceivable comfort. The mansion boasted a piano room, a fireplace in the living rooms, a sophisticated dining room, a rustic wood-paneled office, a TV room equipped with a large projector, a weight-training gym with views of nature, a game room with a pool table, and many other amenities. The master suite, located on the second floor, featured a gigantic walk-in closet and a luxurious bathroom with a spectacular hot tub in the center. The external area of the property was equipped with a beautiful pool and a basketball court. After Tyson's divorce in 2003, the property was ceded to his ex-wife. In 2021, the property was sold for almost $4.6 million. Mansions in Seven Hills Tyson, being a successful fighter, could live anywhere in the world. However, since 2008, he has chosen to reside in a gated community in Seven Hills, Henderson, Nevada. He once owned two properties in this condominium. The first mansion, a beautiful white house of contemporary architecture, featured an outdoor area with an infinity pool, two spas, and an illuminated waterfall. The property, which was about 5,740 square feet, was divided into six bedrooms 
and six luxurious bathrooms. Tyson sold this property for nearly $1.5 million to buy an even more expensive one in the same neighborhood. Currently, Tyson resides in a large two-story mansion of approximately 8,150 square feet. The estate's external area features lush landscaping, a large pool, and a small multi-level water fountain. Tyson is speculated to have purchased the property for around $2.5 million. Excessive Luxuries Tyson is renowned for his extravagant lifestyle. He has owned three pet tigers, each costing around $70,000 and spent around $125,000 a year to maintain them. Tyson also has a penchant for expensive accessories, including a $5,000 Rolex Oyster Perpetual, a $12,000 Cartier Pasha, an $18,000 Rolex Day Day, a $33,000 Hubla Big Bang Unico WBC, a $40,000 Rolex Daytona White Gold, and a diamond bracelet and watch estimated at around $630,000. At the peak of his success, Tyson threw lavish parties, such as his 30th birthday party, which cost him around $400,000. He was also known for his generosity, often gifting luxury cars to his friends. Net Worth Tyson, being one of the best boxers of all time, has amassed a significant fortune throughout his career. Most of his income stemmed from his successful fights, which were broadcast worldwide, earning him a lot of money from pay-per-view. He also had lucrative contracts with television stations like HBO and Showtime. Adding up all his earnings, Tyson earned at least $430 million, equivalent to over $700 million today. However, in 2003, he declared bankruptcy, reporting being $23 million in debt. His financial problems were attributed to his extravagant lifestyle and poor financial management, coupled with his manager Don King taking a large percentage of his earnings. Currently, Tyson seems to have regained his financial stability. He has become a successful businessman, investing in projects like Tyson 2.0, a company that sells cannabis products. He also earns income from social media, his YouTube channel, VIP appearances at events, roles in Hollywood movies, and exhibition fights. While his current net worth is not known, it is estimated to be at least $20 million, a figure that could have been much higher had he managed his wealth better. Mike Tyson's World Tour In an effort to address his financial obligations, Mike Tyson announced his plan to embark on a series of exhibition bouts known as Tyson's World Tour. The purpose of these bouts was to generate income and help pay off his debts. In 2006, Tyson made his return to the ring for his first exhibition match. He faced journeyman heavyweight Corey Sanders in a four-round bout in Youngstown, Ohio. Despite being in decent physical shape, Tyson, who stood at 5 feet 10 in and weighed 216 pounds, was far from his prime. His opponent, Sanders, stood at 6 feet 6 in and wore headgear during the exhibition. It was observed that Tyson appeared to be holding back during the fight, possibly to prolong the show and prevent an early end to the bout. Unfortunately, the first exhibition bout did not receive a favorable response from fans. As a result, the remainder of Tyson's world tour was canceled, and the planned series of exhibitions came to an end. Retirement On June 11, 2005, Mike Tyson made the decision to quit boxing before the start of the seventh round in a closely contested fight against Kevin McBride, who was considered a journeyman in the sport. In the 2008 documentary titled Tyson, he revealed that he took the fight with McBride primarily for financial gain and did not expect to win. He admitted to being in poor physical condition and expressed frustration with taking boxing seriously. After experiencing a string of losses, Tyson announced his retirement from boxing, citing a loss of passion for the sport. In the year 2000, Tyson replaced his entire team and hired new accountants. They prepared a financial statement that showed he began the year with a debt of $3.3 million but earned $65.7 million. However, Tyson faced legal troubles in August 2007 when he pleaded guilty to drug possession and driving under the influence in an Arizona court. This arrest was a result of authorities discovering that Tyson, who had a history of legal issues, had used cocaine on the day of his arrest and admitted to being addicted to the drug. In his autobiography, Undisputed Truth, published in 2013, Tyson confessed to using the urine of his then-wife Monica Turner to pass doping tests. He was married to Turner from 1997 to 2003. Additionally, Tyson admitted to using his infant's urine for the same purpose. Return. 
Mike Tyson's return to the boxing ring was announced in March 2024. He is scheduled to face Jake Paul in a heavyweight bout on July 20, 2024, at 8&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas. This fight has garnered significant attention and anticipation among fans and the boxing community. Enjoying what you see? Hit that like button to show your support. Don't miss out on future updates. Subscribe to stay in the loop. You got something to say? Drop a comment below and let's start a conversation. If you found this helpful, share it with your friends.